Hello everyone, and welcome to PowerApps Portals Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduke, and this is tip number 115, Advanced Portal Theming, Header, Footer. In our last tip, I covered how you can modify the look and feel of your portal using a custom bootstrap theme. A custom bootstrap theme goes a long way to making a PowerApps portal feel on brand for an organization. However, there is one final step that we generally take on our projects that really makes a portal feel like a part of an organization's family of web properties. Implementing a custom header and footer web template. The website record in the Portal Management app has two lookups to web templates that are relevant for portal theming, header template and footer template. As you might expect, the header template controls what appears in the header of your portal, and the footer template controls what appears in the footer of your portal. As web templates, you can include HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and Liquid to achieve almost any layout that you want. You can implement a header or footer that has a dark background or a light background. Using Liquid with web link sets allows you to create a content manageable menu that can be left, right, or center aligned. You can even use the header template to make the primary menu appear along the side of the page instead of at the top. The existing templates are a great starting point if you're new to Bootstrap or Liquid. We typically will create new web templates for the header and footer, instead of editing the existing ones. That way we always have the originals as reference. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the PowerApps Portals tip number 115 on Advanced Portal Theming Header Footer useful.